Driving without a license, driving without insurance, not wearing a seat belt, having no tax disc displayed, driving over the legal speed limit, driving under the influence of alcohol, allowing another person to drive your vehicle under the influence of alcohol. <laughs> In the region of £5,000 of parking fees owing, £6,000 of damage to property, charges of assault and abuse, the charges of attempted murder and robbery have been dropped. <laughs> My name is Patsy Stone. I'm an alcoholic. <laughs> I'm what she did was an act of humanitarian mercy. That is hardly a reason to steal a crate of champagne. Have you any idea how much champagne costs these days? <laughs> I, was, I was forced to steal it. My daughter wouldn't have allowed me to buy it. I must ask you to sit down and stop wasting the court's time. The sum of £50,000 to be paid by you in damages, and a further fine of £2,000. You will also be liable for all costs incurred. Well, getting rid of the driver is a little bit of a false economy, isn't it? A lifetime <laughs> ban on driving. And finally, Mrs Monsoon... Can I just say one word in my defence? Hmm? I don't think that's a good idea, Mum. Your mouth is working for the prosecution. No, this is what I do well, sweetie. I might get some little tips for the debating society. You never know. <laughs> Without notes, sir. Thank you, thank you. Right. I, the proposed accused, think that... Well, I mean, you know, the day in question was not a good day for me, all right? But I, I put it to you that I don't see how any day could have been the way this bloody country's run. I mean, you know, I was just trying to do my best. Trying to get from A to B, do a little shopping. I was trying to take control of my life, you know. Only to find that actually it is controlled for me by petty bureaucracy and bits of bloody paper. <laughs> ignorant bloody petty rules and laws that just obstruct every tiny little action until you find you've committed a crime without even knowing. <laughs> I mean, you know, why can't life just be made a little easier for everybody, huh? Why can't it be more like the continent, hmm? You know, where a man can just park his car on the pavement and then run down the street in front of charging bulls whilst letting fireworks off out of his bloody nostrils without anyone thinking of an eye, huh? Because it's probably a local holiday and nobody's at work because they all want to have just a little bit of fun and they're not intimidated by some outdated work ethic. I mean, there has to be more to life than just being safe. Is there a point to all this? <laughs> yes, yes. Why, oh, why do we pay taxes? Mm? <laughs> I mean, just to have bloody parking restrictions and buggery, ugly traffic wardens and bollocky pedestrian bloody crossings, you know? <laughs> and those bastard railings outside shops so you can't even get in them! I mean, I know they're there to stop stupid people running into the street and killing themselves, but we're not all stupid! We don't all need nursemaiding! I mean, why not just have a stupidity tax? Just tax the stupid people! Die! Yes! Any more of this ridiculous rant and I'll put you both away! Here, here. <laughs> Edwina Margaret Rose Monsoon, I hereby sentence you to... Come in. <laughs> it's all your bloody fault you know this. 